Do you know that Mr. Thomas Edison was not the first man who invented the light bulb? Can you believe that? Yo, it's Melvin here and yes, Mr. Thomas Edison was not the first man who invented the light bulb. The first man who invented the light bulb was Patrick de Molins, but his light bulbs was burned out too quickly and it was not useful for consumers. Few years later, Thomas Edison invented a light bulb which can light up for 600 hours. That day onwards, he became rich and started a new company named Edison Manufacturing Company. So let me introduce a new character, Mr. Elon's friend, Nikola Tesla. So Nikola Tesla arrived in New York in 1884 and he was hired as an engineer at Edison's company. At one point, Edison told Tesla that he would pay $50,000 if Tesla improved his DC motors. After months of hard work, Tesla finally found a solution. After presenting his solution, Mr. Tesla asked for the $50,000 contract. And Mr. Edison jokingly said, You won't understand American humors. <laughs> Tesla was shocked and disappointed. After that incident, he quickly quit from that company. So during this time, there was a rich man in New York named George Westinghouse. George Westinghouse was interested with Nikola's idea. With the help of George Westinghouse, Nikola finally able to start up a new AC power system near Boston. So what is AC and DC? AC DC. AC means alternative current, which can travel up to 100 miles. And DC means direct current. It can only travel up to 2 miles. But the disadvantage of AC current is, it is too powerful. To prove that, Edison even put a prisoner to death by an electric chair, which powered by AC current. Can you believe that? Eventually, Tesla heard the news, so he called Michael Bay to send Autobots, the Transformers. And this is how Transformers work. They take the high voltage and make it low and vice versa. But unfortunately, George Westinghouse became bankrupt. And then Mr. Tesla just gave him his multi-million contract to George. And Tesla lived his last decades in a hotel at New York. He spent his final years by feeding and communicating with the birds. On this day, he died penniless and alone in his hotel room. So do you know what happened after that? Of course, Tesla won the battle. You know why? If you are watching this video on YouTube, you are using AC current. Nevertheless, we use DC current also, like batteries. And, and, and. By the way, if you are in 19th century, who will you support? Edison or Tesla? Leave your opinion at the comment section down below. If you found this video useful, Hit the like button and subscribe button and hit the bell notification to stay notified and as always keep this covered. So George Westinghouse was so George Westinghouse was so George Westinghouse was <laughs> <laughs> Sí, sí, sí.